your guys going to throw it back on ever Gavs. Final Fantasy video on the sorry about that, but no no. Sorry I drank a coffee for this one. Just need 300 more XP and then I'm good to go. If we defeat Barnabas, we get one more icon. And do we have to get Joe's icon as well? I feel like we do. And then we'll be fully complete with the whole thing. The Nato might know something. Cole said it was an army of a cash. How are we supposed to do our duty when the hills are... We need to God. find Jill. If you're here, where the hell is everyone else? Don't tell me. They're all right. But it's a long story. We need to find Jill. I can't imagine, I can't imagine what, they're going to do, what they're doing to her right now. You lot don't do things by halves, do you? <laughs> well, at least everyone's still breathing. Now, as for these writings... I'm sorry to say, Clive, but if you had those, you'd be sitting under a pile of rubble. I know. But we were able to save a few bits and pieces from the ruins, most of which ended up being used to build this place. The more personal items we gave to the next of kin. In the case of Sid's things, that would have been mid. I know that the mid was Sid's daughter. I was looking something. If Amber and the Lazarus are gone, then do you think this ship will ever say? I'm Amber. This looks like it's from Sid's old diary. I'd better keep looking. What do we have here? It says pipes. Oh yeah, he used to smoke. We've had no word from Canva for days. Please tell me Mid is all right. She's fine. How come Sid never mentioned her to be his daughter? <coughs> Sorry, everyone. What's this tucked inside it? My demo, I know you like your resume. Can you please tell all my vegetables best? I wouldn't choose to play that. I got to work on that last one. Huh. Sid's best invention. Hmm. That sounds promising. So Sid hid something in Mid's first opus. What would that be? Perhaps Otto might know. Who would you if I want to do something real quick? Because I feel, because I heard that, on, that later on, there should be a quest for Torgal. So I want to see if I find that quest. I normally don't do quests, but um, since Torgal's the best boy, I do anything for that wolf, like he did for us. Now I'm pretty sure it should be around on the stairs. Let's stand. If it's knowledge you seek, you are. Wait, first things first. I haven't been around to blast for ages. Need to upgrade my weapons and armor. So will it be? Uh, 
No scratches, all right? It last you a good while. Don't waste my time. You ain't got the stuff. You can thank me later. Bring me the materials, and I'll think about it. Young med. Yeah, it's turn on. Is she request for toggle? Where do I find it? What do you reckon we should do? No, it doesn't matter. I'll find it later. Deaf as a banshee, unless you mean mm. the orchestrion. She couldn't have been more than what, 11, 12, when she cobbled that thing together. It surprised us all, not least her dad. You should have seen how proud he was of the little scamp. What's that battered old box had to do with anything? I think Sid may have hidden something inside it. <laughs> Wouldn't surprise me. Those two and their bloody treasure hunts. Half the things in the hideaway were hidden one time or another. How are we supposed to do our duty when the hills are crawling with a kashik and the valleys are full of it? Um, excuse me. Break it. Well, I didn't break it. What didn't you break? Nothing. We didn't break nothing. We definitely didn't break your question. <sighs> What's wrong with it? It's broken. Except when it isn't. <sighs> I don't think it is. See? And you had nothing to do with this? Nope. Nothing. We just wanted to listen to all the songs at once. <laughs> So we press all the buttons. Of course. Like this. No, 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 don't, don't do it again. See? All too well. All right, out of the way. Let's see, it's, let's do this then. Let's see what's inside this fin. This so 
cord on one of the gears. Did you break it? Can you fix it? No, I mean, yeah, yes. There. How about now? You fixed it! You said fixed it! He more than fixed it! Yeah, new music! Huh. Never heard this one before. They started playing when I removed this. Whatever it is. Well, don't look at me. No, I mean, I don't know what that is. is. Maybe Mid Since knows something about it. And said, as much. said it was the stuff dreams were made of. <sighs> Let's just hope it's the stuff ships are made of as well. Indeed. Let's see if we can make some dreams come true. Score! Finally! 6,242. Uh, Pardon me. Now can follow upgrade by Harmut. Just the two I was looking for. Aye, aye. Who's a patient? Actually, yes. The Crown Prince just left. Dion left? Unless you've another word for stood up and walked off. Yes. Where'd he go? He did have the decency to leave a message with Obelis before commandeering one of his dinghies. Should we go after him? No. Why not? We're not the Prince's keepers. He's free to do as he sees fit. I'd rather sure? he did so in bed. His wounds are nowhere near healed. Much like yours, I suspect. Otto told me what happened in Canver. What is it with this realm's princes and their aversion to rest? Uh, ask me when I get back. Though I may be some time. Then at least try to stay safe. And if that fails, try to stay alive, eh? Every moment I waste here, the further the flagship sails, I have to get back. <sighs> Sorry. I put stuff on my phone. Come on, let's go find Jill. First. Yes, the power is mine. Also, gonna need to upgrade this one. No need, I, uh, no need actually. Forget, forget what I said. <sighs> Alright, let's go to Iron Works. We need to find Jill.
Clive? My dad had it all worked out. He'd be proud of you, Mid. His writings may have helped, but this achievement is all yours. <laughs> Can we catch them? The Inea is one of the largest, fastest vessels ever built. And it won't help she has the wind at her back. Any other ship would be hard pressed to keep pace with her, let alone reel her in. But this isn't any other ship. This is the Enterprise! And the world's never seen anything like my dad's engine. It certainly hasn't. Clive, what do you know of Barnabas Tharm? Only what the bards sing. And he sailed to Ash from southern lands. But it was his mastery of the blade which won him the throne. And that his sword, Odin's sword, can sever the very threads of creation. But don't lose any sleep over a last tilt. We'll do what we must to survive. What we must. The light! I thought this curve was meant to be hidden! Ah, god damn it, we're compromised! Mid! Company! Hey? We'll hold them off until the ship is ready! But hurry! Oh Jesus Christ. Oh shit, that was that doesn't matter. Jesus Christ.
Nah, I forgot to go suck on potions again. I really gotta stop doing that. There we go. Any more of these punks? That was easy enough. Don't say that. Someone, when someone, when someone usually says that, it always gets a whole lot harder. That's a jinx. Clive. What? You? I thought we killed you. But I thought he was confounded. Then it is as I feared. What? Sleipnir is no man, but a creation of Odin. Seriously? Ah, crap. Here we go again. Oh, god damn it. Well, this is going to be harder. Phoenix's fiery fundament. Have you no normal enemies? Time for a fight. Up for another round? Of course we are. Right, Lord Rosfield? My boy, there was a time people called me the Executioner. Or was it my ass? No matter, heads will roll all the same. Mate, new plan! You leave, we follow! Follow? Swimming, are you? Oh, bugger me! Weigh anchor! Engine's dead slow ahead! It doesn't matter. Well, I've already killed at least five of the I'm after the other one, but. Fuck it. Let's do the last. Let's do these people. It gets charged up. In your own time, guy. Ah, leave him. Run! Behind you! Yeah. Alright, look, let's just run. Come on! Clive, come on! Run!
That was close. Jesus Christ. Now, mate. Right, Hold on tight. That's what I said. All right, now let's now we can finally go find Jill. Hope she's all right. Jill. What do you want of her, you what bastard? You That's quite a mess you've made. And wholly unnecessary. <sighs> You are my offering to Muthos. I would not see you damaged. Now back to your stations! Every bell spent treading water puts another league between us and the Galleon. I don't suppose Mid has a spare engine. <laughs> Since you rose from the grave, my fortunes have plummeted. Are you absolutely certain of this quest of yours, Five? The foes you face are as terrible as they are numerous. Aye. I know. And they'd have us live and die on their terms, which should answer your question. <laughs> You have that same stubborn look as your father did when he set his mind to something. On the battlefield, I am but a single axe. A deadly one, mind, but a single one nonetheless. Yet what you require is a thousand, and I believe my old friend in Brandalar can provide them. Take care, Clive. I have many more tales of your father's exploits to share. And I cannot very well do that if you're dead. Again. Good luck, Uncle. And may fair winds attend you. As for you, Joshua, take care. I shall do my best, Uncle. Farewell, my nephews. When next you see me, it shall be with an army at my back. Do keep up, my boy. Well, we can't have him showing us up now, can we? We would never hear the end of it. Mm -hmm. Sam Breck. Die on. Riga of mercy. Have you seen what you've done?
this. It... What have I done? The medicine girl. She's still alive. But any ship heading north has to round Zemeckis and put through the narrow. Maintain our current bearing north northeast, and we'll catch the Black Galleon before she vanishes again. What's to prevent her from circling around Ash from the south? With these winds in those waters, it'd take forever and a fortnight to reach Stone here. Mid knows what she's talking about, Clive. Better than any of us, lot, anyway. I say we do as she tells. Sails on the horizon. She's ours. Look ahead, boys. Full oh, ahead. And keep those furnaces fed. Aye, aye. Do you feel that? Jill? Feel what? You feel her? Let's see what this girl can do. That's where Jill is. Let's go. Wait, what about Barnabas? We need to do with him too. Yep. We need to do with this guy. And he's already too powerful. Where one leads, so does the other follow. The bond of consciousness which joins them, condemning both to the same fate. Yet my every attempt to strike it from their hearts serves only to tighten its hold. Fascinating. His icon form. There is naught my blade cannot sever. I expected more, but never mind. Uh oh! Great Woo! That was close. Oh, let's please have you have get some Joshua. The Maelstrom. 
Let's go. Need to load them all in one place so they at least the flank rebirth. Over here, you assholes. And now! Yeah! 836. Who's next, eh? Wait, the How was that? I was just gonna need help. No. There he is. He wants him alive. If I find Joe, then we help Hold Joshua. On.
There's only so much I can take. Well done, to me, boy. To me, boy. Die! Die! There we go. I think we already been here for. Excuse me, Coco. Jill? Jill. You oh, there you are. You all right? You okay? Clive, how did you? I'll explain later. Had. Can you walk? Out of here, I can. Come on. The others need our help. Before me, but a guttering flame. Where'd he go? Oh, boy. What's he doing? Odin. He's the dominant of Odin. Oh, boy. Here we go. The Norse God. In honest, then. We're going to need a freight. Uh, 
Oh, what the hell is... Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, boy. Would please have a jail pop before we go off there. How do we get up? How do we get back up now? You, you okay? Can you go on? I think so. How is this even possible? But to where? What is it? Ah, oh, great. You again. Is Odin still up there? Or... We're gonna need Joshua's help for this you. one. What did you do to Joshua? The Phoenix? Oh, I expect he will survive. This consciousness in which you coil your feeble souls is grown thick with desperation. And thus has my master turned to my blade. The world will soon be painted in black. And all that live shall gather in death's autumn wake. Not if we remove the cause of this misery. Not if we destroy the last of the Mother Crystals and restore balance to the world. I thought we destroyed all the Mother Crystals. There's only one left. I think it's so simple. The blight is inevitable. Not even the Almighty might stop its endless march. Your efforts will avail us naught. Naught, that is, but suffering. You must embrace the truth, Mythos. Accept your place with the Lord. Keep it. As long as there's a chance, there's a choice. Ever led astray by your blind resolve. Now, it is time you learn the inevitability of your divine fate, however much it may hurt. Get as far away as you can. Clive, no. Trust me, Jill. You better want to get last time. I wish you could do it again. We need Joshua's help for this one. <sighs> Toggle, you with me? We don't have to do this. Oh, but we do. If only to remind you of what in the short time since our last meeting, you have grown much. It as a vessel, I fear my lord will still find you. Blackie. Fire and fury, 
And for what? Stopping your blight. A foolish notion fed to you by a foolish man. How dare you? You know thought of this world nor of our place in it. If our fates were so easily rewritten, we would all be gods. Let's roll. Oh boy. Die. Oh shit. That's roll. Not again! Come on, Joshua, where are you when I need you? You would yield so soon. Never. Come on, Clive, get up. you down, dragging you ever further from your purpose. And what is my purpose? Mythos. Who are we? What are the dominance? The breath of the Creator still warm on our lips. We carry his light that we might guide the masses in his name. We are but mighty acts of God. We are more than that. You would be nothing without what he has granted you. The power we wield is his, and yet every time we draw upon it, it wears away at our very being. It breaks us, it unmakes us, that mm. its immaculate aspect might reveal itself. The icon. It is too much for even his chosen few. Apart from you, Mythos. You wield the might of many, yet your body does not answer for its avarice. What are you saying? What I am saying... ...is that we dominance are a means to an end. We were created for you. That you might drink deep of our strength, and thereby fulfill your divine purpose. Which is... ...to feed. As you would know, could you only look beyond the walls of your prison of self-regard. As long as you choose to ignore this, you shall never penetrate my defenses. Still, you may take solace in the fact that you are not alone in your plight. The chains of volition shackle all of mankind, but there is yet cause to rejoice. For the Lord, in his mercy, has taken pity on his flawed creations, and shall see them restored to their proper forms. And what exactly would that be? Why, loyal servants to God.
We're not servants to God. We're ser we're <sighs> our own people. Manners, Lord Rossfield. They are men like you and me. Albeit ones uh, unburdened by the wills that drive our kind to madness. They are pure. They are divine. You mean to turn everyone Akashic? Not turn, Mythos. Turn back. For too long has mankind been led astray by their clamorous wills. It is time they return to a world of quiet equality, where they might once more know salvation. Salvation? And abandon everything we hold dear? We don't need your salvation. We'll save ourselves, and we'll do it on our own terms. Not I just yours. noticed that the John told him to go back with every those defiant clients. expression of your will. The, the chains of consciousness become. But perhaps that fact may be put to use. <sighs> Clive! Ah, shit! The faster it binds you to the remaining dominance, the stronger your hunger will be. Come, until it leads you back to the only answer there ever was. Mayhap not by the path my master intended, but back all the same. Ash is not far. I could freeze a path. You're in no fit state. Probably not, but I can try. <sighs> Don't look back. Five bested. Really? The others are safe. The group, yeah, me too. was clear of the gap when we fell. They made it, Jill. And they will have seen the ice. Where it led. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, wow. Hmm. This is awkward, but I'm gl glad to see that. Wow. Okay, then. This is the second time Barnabas has bested me. Powerless against him. I mean, with all your icons you absorbed. Maybe there really is nothing else for it but to give yourself to his master. There has to be another way. We can't let this happen. Only you won't do that. The Clive I know would never do that. Seriously, if, if, if now is the best time for you two to make your feelings to each other, now would be a very good time. Don't believe what Barnabas says, all right? You're your own person with your own free will. You decide what's best. I burn away the things that make me who I am. Do you, though? Think of what you've used that power for. Of all the people you've saved. It doesn't matter how or by whom it was granted. Only how you choose to use it. And you've chosen to use it for good, haven't you? I've also used it to kill. You used it to survive. What if that's my purpose? What if 
it's all I'm good for. You're still that same boy I grew up with. Most of all, you, Clive, you, you never once took the time to save yourself. Myself, I think I might be beyond saving. No one is beyond saving, provided they want to be saved. You fight to survive. And you survive so that you may protect those you love. It's what you do. What you've always done. I know you're not about to change. So I'm going to help you. To give you what you need to protect us all. Come on now. Now will be a very good time for you too. Are you really sure about this? Don't worry, Clive. It is. <sighs> this burden. I'll give you the strength to bear it alone. I'm not really comfortable with taking Joe's icon, but I mean, part of it, but still. Find a way to escape this fate. Sorry, for one. Find a way to save each other. Come on, do it already.
And I promise you, Clive, that I will be there, no matter what you might. I thought a smile could bring me so much joy. Finally, Jesus Christ, that took too long. Finally, finally, finally. I was not sure how much more I could take more of this romantic tension. Now it's done. Finally! Uh. What of Barnabas? Do we pursue him? Mm-hmm. No. Our paths will cross again soon enough. Whether we like it or not. Besides, there is something we must do first. What is that? Of course. Drake's spine. Yeah, I learned before we destroyed all the mother crystals. There's one more left. The last mother crystal. Where is it located? The Einherja is at the bottom of the sea. Walud won't dare move on storm without her. But they know we're coming now. We'll need a plan. And a damn good one at that. Then let's go home and find one. Ash will have to wait. Yeah. I promise. Back to the hideaway. says Odin split the sea in two. She's always been partial to a tall tale. It's the truth. It's tall, and then there's tall. I struggle to believe it myself. I see your uncle isn't with you. He stayed with the Enterprise. After our brush with the Einherja, she was in urgent need of repair. And my uncle knows a shipwright in Randalar. We're to join him there when we're ready to sell for Ash. You sure that's wise? Last I heard, the place was still overrun with a Kashyyyk. Show me a city where that isn't true. Ultima's plague is spreading. 
We're running out of time, aren't we? We've done our best to shore up that hideaway. But I doubt a few planks will stop what's coming. Still, we'll keep at it. Every little helps, I suppose. Let's hope so. The power of ice. I should visit Joshua. Assuming Tahi will allow. There's only one more. The power of Odin, and we're and, and then all the actions will be completed. Let's see what Shiva text has. Damn. Let's test that Shiva's ability. I'm here. What? Hmm. This was what? So I want to see how much this does well. If this does well, then I'm going to use, reform the Clive Sid's power and then use it to Jill's. That's what I'll do. Sorry, Jill. I'm... How are you feeling, Joshua? You okay? Better than I was. But not nearly as well as you should be. Your cuts and burns may have healed, but your body still bears the burden of every spell cast. Then what would you have had me do? It was no ordinary foe we faced. It was the Warden of Darkness. Yet that guy's powerful. Was not enough. The king could have ended me at any moment, but instead chose to toy with me like a curl does a mouse. Yeah. You underestimate yourself. Oh, it was crystal clear. Only one man established his dominance that day, and that man was Barnabas. I'm sorry, brother. That was ill-spoken. It's just... I have never felt so powerless. And when so many are looking to us for strength, perhaps... Uh, perhaps the prince feels the same. You could need a Wonderful, wonderful. All right. Die on.
What is this place? Don't move. It's fresh from the well. Uh. Oh my god. <laughs> told me spirits sometimes get lost and that the lanterns guide them to their proper place I set one on the river for her when she passed away Was it you who guided my hand then, Ultima? No, not you. This is my doing, my fault, my sin to bear. And for it, I must atone. Your hurts are healing nicely. It was my poultices that saw you well. You make them. And sell them. Or try to. Earns me enough for bread, most days. Forgive me. I have nothing to... I know, but I couldn't just leave you lying there. <sighs> You're going then? Of course. I'm healed. Thanks to you and your poultices. Will you promise to come back and visit? Phoenix, it would seem that I owe you my wings. Perhaps he can find an answer. You will be returning to Walud soon, I gather. I see no reason to wait. Then neither do I. I can think of a few, but I doubt they'll stop you. You will take your medicine. Of course, Lady Tyre. Set on leaving already, are you? How long will it take us to get back to Ash? Dunno, about the same amount of time it took us to get here. Maybe less, if your uncle can find someone trustworthy to patch up the Enterprise. All depends on where we're putting into port, mind. Yes, it's not as if we can put ashore wherever we choose. We have to assume that the whole of Ash is hostile, and that we'll be attacked on sight. Then we must find a place they won't think to look. And I have an idea who might know of one. The Professor! I'll go and tell you coming! While you're plotting our course, I'll be in the shelves with your lawsmen, 
I wish to pick his brains about Ultima. Then I'll talk to Karen about supplies for the journey. They may not be easy to come by in Ash. Your brother's body won't take much more of this recklessness. You know that, don't you? I do. I was wondering when you'd arrive. Please tell me you've come to take our young prodigy here off my hands. I'm not here for mid. I need information on Ash. Then why not ask Molly if you can look in one of her ovens? <sighs> Go on. As soon as the Enterprise is ready, we'll be setting out for Drake's spine. And we're going to need a safe place to land. Preferably one that won't see my ship blown to shit and splinters. If it were that easy, do you think Walud would have resisted invasion for so long? Very little is known of Ash, and the information we do have is spotty and outdated. We have the good King Barnabas to thank for that. Walud's borders have been closed to outsiders since the day he seized the throne. If there is anywhere safe to land, you won't find it on my map. Then tell us what we will find. I'm sure you know better than we do. But no splinters! All right, all right, if it will get you out of my hair. But interrupt me, and it's over. Understood? Barnabas Tharm, the one they call the last king. Understand him, and you will understand the kingdom of Walud. Barnabas was only a boy when he arrived from beyond the southern seas, and barely a man before he united the ragged tribes of Ash. And having unleashed them upon the formidable Veldemark, he set his throne upon the ancient kingdom's ruins. The victory sent shockwaves around Valisthea, Tales of Odin's might spreading through every court, parlor, and drinking hall in the realm. Note that this was in the year 843, and that the king still sits upon his throne some 40 years later, quite untouched by time. Walud's recent inaction left many wondering if Odin had lost his appetite for war. And yet here we are. The Einherjar was committed to the fray, a bold declaration of intent. Orcs swarm around Drake's Fang, and throngs of Akashic haunt canvas streets. Though how precisely the havoc they wreak serves Walud remains unclear. Regardless, if the order to attack truly came from King Barnabas, then one thing is certain. Walud has achieved the impossible and made bedfellows of beast men and the ether adult alike. All of which is a roundabout way of saying that you will be in unknown territory when you set foot on Ash. Much of the continent has already been lost to the blight, and what few ports remain will be fiercely guarded. And that is to say naught of its natural defenses. Offshore currents will cast an ill-equipped ship out to sea one moment, and dash it against the rocks the next. But then the Enterprise is anything but ill-equipped, and Mid has made land there before. Now, if only there were someone with an intimate knowledge of the Shadow Coast, and where a daring gentleman might put ashore. You see, Clive, you had the answer all along. Do you think you can get us back to that beach, mid? Oh, seriously? We have to go back there? Not that it were easy. The currents were right, bastard. But then, if it wasn't hard, it wouldn't be worth doing, would it? Agreed. 
Thank you, Lady Vivian. If a few morsels of common knowledge and a sprinkling of tavern talk are worthy of your thanks, I wonder what genuine intelligence might earn me. Probably more visits. Mid, I need everyone in the ale hall now. I'll fetch Joshua from the shelves. Aye, aye, Captain. All right, Joshua. You must listen to this. Lawsman, tell him. Do you oh, know when we spoke before on the divinity of Ultima? Well, it inspired me to delve deeper into the subject. And what I discovered appears to agree with the findings of his grace. You will recall that my quest to uncover Ultima's origins began with the mural at Phoenix Gate. But while I've always known it to be important, its secrets have heretofore eluded me. Now, however, I believe I know where to find the more complete example. One that will reveal all we seek. Master Clive, have you ever in your travels chanced to hear of the Circle of Malleus? I would think not, if you have. But there was once a time when the faith flourished, the oldest known religion in the Twins. And though its popularity eventually waned on storm, hints of its dogma remain embedded in more modern faiths such as the Crystalline Orthodox. Wait. You said it waned on storm. What of ash? Religious monuments are often torn down or repurposed when new faiths rise to prominence. But if no new faith arose, then perhaps the ancient temples might still stand. And so, you see now why I must accompany you to Walud. It would appear the past still has much to teach us. Though in this case, it would not have been possible without the musings of Moss. <laughs> mm. To think that you carried a copy of my old mentor's chronicles all along. I am relieved to discover it in good hands. I shall guard it with my life. Joshua, if you're finished here, join me in the ale hall. I need to speak to everyone before we leave. Right away. If it please your grace, might I one day borrow the chronicles for a short while? Mid said I could ride the Enterprise next. No, she did. She said I could. My apologies. Mm. By now you've all heard where we're going and why. So I won't bother you with the boring details, only the important ones. If we attempt to approach Stone here by sea, there's a good chance we'll be sighted and fall prey to the capital's artillery. So instead, we'll disembark on the southwest coast and make for Drake's spine on foot. I say we, but... It's highly likely the entirety of Ash is under the rule of Ultima. A large party would only attract unwanted attention. As well as slow our march and require supplies which may be difficult to obtain. Only Joshua and I will be going. And a scout. Preferably a good one. Gav, do you know of any? You bet your ass I do. <laughs> Might still borrow some of Lady Vivian's maps though. Just in case, like. Once you've dropped us off at the Shadow Coast, you need to retreat into neutral waters, fly merchant colors, and stay inconspicuous. If you sense any danger at all, you leave us behind and return to Storm. Inconspicuous is my middle name. But like hell am I leaving anyone behind. The ship ain't going nowhere till your scurvy mugs are smiling on deck. Jill, 
The Enterprise will appear a tempting target for royalists and pirates alike. You're to stop anyone boarding. Don't worry. I'll keep the ship and her crew safe. You'll be needing passage home, after all. But... <sighs> Very well. What's with you? Okay. If there are no questions, I'll see you all at the docks. Let me know when you're leaving. I want a word before you go. What is it? Of course. Now while I'm here, I'm finally going to stock up on potions. Oh, don't tell me we've run out of peppy nuts and all. Aye, it's a dangerous world out there. I need some potions, please. Find a better price than that. You're rubbing me blind, you know. You'll not find a better price than that. Thank you so much for this. Me blind, you know. Last look, sir. Ooh. So it's based like a resurrection stone. Perfect. You'll not find a better price than that. Don't really need this. I'm be thankful you got that much. You got out else? Finished, are you? Yeah. The stews all for What do you want? And all right. Oh, I didn't know we could do that. No oh, mind. Hmm. This one's fine. It's not the same as this. I prefer Toggle's one. Uh, this one's good. Oh. Rune Blade. Actually, wait, let me take a look at this. The uh, Invictus will do. Wait, hang on. This one's much more fitting. Alright, what is it? Oh, there's the is something wrong? Not at all. Honestly. Can't a man wish his friend farewell? Just wanted to let you know that I'll keep things in order while you're off saving the world. I'll hold you to that. Hmm. I don't mind. Reckon it'll be a long walk to the capital if we follow the cliffs. I'll scout ahead. See if I can't find us an inland route.
Clive. Hmm. Mm. There's something I've been meaning to ask. You took her icon, didn't you? Yeah, I didn't want it either, but um, she wanted it to happen. Yes, I did. She understood. Oh shit! Well, I was not expecting that. Oh, she understood. Understood that you decided to save the world all on your own, and that you'd die without her power. How dare you make her choose? You knew damn well she'd never refuse you. But I will. You can't keep pushing us away, Clive. The world is ours to save, not yours. I used my gift because I thought it was the right thing to do. And you truly believe this will save you, <clears throat> will save us all? I do. Then so be it. We need all the powers of Icon. Just don't forget. You're not alone. Yeah. As much as, as, much as Ultima wants all of it, we have to stop him. I think I found us a trail. Uh, did I miss something? Uh, no. No, it's fine. Only that Joshua didn't. Mm-hmm. I don't get it. Always wanted to visit Ash. I'll put you guys out the car right here. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in the next Final Fantasy video. Peace out, everyone.